What's up guys? Welcome to a new video. Today we're going to be going over three quick tips if you're a diabetic trying to get in the gym and start to get healthy. Let's get into it. Alright guys, tip number one is just to start going. It doesn't matter if you're going to the gym all the time or just starting to work out from home start going get on a healthier lifestyle but the most important thing is to just get started Alrighty guys, tip number two is prepare for glucose swings. So more times than I've ever been able to count, mid-workout, my blood sugar just spikes. It ramps right up. So usually before I start my workout, about 15 minutes before I start my workout, I do four to five units, depending on what my blood sugar is before, to compensate for that blood sugar going up. The reason I think it goes up is like the adrenaline spike or your liver pumping out glycogen stores when your muscles are being depleted as you're working out. So that's what that's why I dose before then. And then after the workout, I tend lately I've been tending to drop low. So just be prepared and have some snacks with you just in case you go low because you got to make it home from the gym. All right, guys, it's actually the next day. Went and got a haircut today. Just got back from the gym, and it's time for tip number three. It took me a little bit longer to think of this one because I had to think of what to say, really. Um, so what I come up with is really just when you're getting started lifting in the gym as a diabetic or getting started being healthy, st give, start slow. Give yourself a little bit of time. It's gonna take time for you to, for your body to adjust and you to get even get into a routine. So if you start slow, give yourself time for recovery. If you're just like hitting the weights and stuff, I would probably start on honestly like a three day split and give yourself a day in between every day that you actually work out and hit the gym. Um, it took me a long time to actually get into this and I was always like achy and sore and my body hurt all the time and my blood sugars were all over the place because I wasn't giving myself time for recovery and not paying attention to my sugar levels. So guys, that is three quick tips for beginning weightlifters as a diabetic. Thank you guys for watching. If you have any comments or questions, please put them down below and stay tuned for the next video. We should have a lot more diabetic related content coming your guys' way. Thanks for watching.